Hey everybody, it's Rosemary Jane and I'm going to be showing you how to get your littlest learners logged in to um, Clever and Schoology on their iPads using QR badges. So teachers, the first thing you're going to need to do is go into your Clever accounts, go to your classes at the top, click on your homeroom or whatever set of badges that you need. Just remember this is for preschool, kindergarten, and first grade only. All other students need to log in using Google. So again, preschool, kindergarten, first grade only. You can download your class set of badges right there. Then you'll also wanna go into your Schoology course. And in any one of your courses, um, probably your homeroom is gonna be the best one for preschool, kindergarten, or first grade. You just go um, on the side panel to members, click on members. And you can get a class badge for an individual student or you can also print all your QR codes and that will print from right there. So I have this slide deck that I'm gonna have attached to this video and posted for you as well, um, showing you how students log in. Right now I'm gonna show it on this iPad. I know it's a little picture in picture, so I'll make it a little bigger. There we go, it should help. All right, so I'm on a CPS iPad and I'm just opening it and I am going to launch the Clever app. And then at the bottom of the app, I'm gonna choose Login with Clever Badges. So this part of the video is good for your families at home too. Now you have to allow camera access, and then you just scan your badge. I've got my badge off to the screen. It takes the student straight into their account. Then they can just go to whatever app you want them to go to, Schoology, they launch that. See at the bottom, log in with QR code. Now you will probably get a message that pops up that says you have to allow the camera, so just do that. But then all your child will have to do is hold up their Schoology badge in front of the camera and it will log them right into that as well. So again, let me shrink this back down. We are going to download our class badges from Clever, download our class badges from Schoology, and then make sure we share those with our families. Um, when I was in the classroom, I would just make my students little um, index cards with their badges. So ideally you could, if you're making materials that are going home anyway, you could put one badge on one side of a card and one on another. If you have to send them digitally, make sure you don't send the whole badge file to a family because that'll give them all of them. You would wanna take your snipping tool and snip those badges. So let's imagine for a moment that this slide is my printout of my badges I would just take my snipping tool and I would make sure that William only gets William's badge. Um, so make sure that you snip that, you can copy it, and then you can paste it in an email to the parent or in a direct Schoology message, you can post it. Um, I have tested them, they work on a screen. So as long as you have the badge, um, just make sure you get those to your families. Again, on their iPads, best way to do that is log into Clever first and then go to Schoology. If they use the Schoology mobile app on the iPad or from an iPhone or Android, um, really fun and engaging things like your um, images posted to updates, they don't show up on the iPad um, or Android um, mobile app. So you're best to use Badge into Clever and then just go through the browser and badge in that way. So Clever, Badge in, Schoology, Badge in, or if a parent um, wants to help their child log in with their Google account, you can provide that for them as well. So even down to preschool, we have accounts for at CincinnatiPS.org. So again, that's at CincinnatiPS.org, and you'll need to provide your parents' um, login credentials. If you want them to use tools like um, in Google, like Flipgrid, or if you want them to be able to do a Google Doc or Google Drawing, those are a lot of fun, especially for young learners, but you'll need to provide that separately. So again, Clever Badges, Schoology Badges, and get those little learners using their iPads for remote learning. Thanks for watching. Bye.